At possible breakthrough in the nuclear standoff with North Korea, President Trump responding to South Korea's claim that the North is prepared to negotiate with the U.S. And our chief global affairs correspondent, Martha Raddatz, is right here in the studio with us, has the latest. Good, good morning, Robin. This really is a breakthrough. The North Koreans say they will suspend those nuclear tests, they will suspend those missile tests if they begin talks. And what the U.S. had said, what Donald Trump had said, is you have to talk about denuclearization. North Korea has agreed to this. There is guarded optimism, but this is what President Trump said. I think that their statement and the statements coming out of South Korea and North Korea have been very positive. That would be a great thing for the world. Great thing for the world. So we'll see how it all comes about. And we have no idea when that will happen, but it looks like it really might happen. They'll start talking about that. Does the president deserve some credit here? I, I think he deserves some credit here. Some people might call it the madman theory that Kim Jong-un didn't know what President Trump would do, but there's been sanctions, there have been threats. So we'll see what happens. And again, promising. He seems to be itching for that meeting. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Martha. Thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.